Well, tonight we're highlighting one of the most important groups of people during the pandemic, our educators. A Rochester teacher from Century High School has made history. Natalia Benjamin is the 2021 Minnesota Teacher of the Year and the first from the Rochester School District and the first Latinx teacher to receive this huge honor. ABC 6 News reporter Mackenzie Davis has a story. The 2021 Minnesota Teacher of the Year is Natalia Benjamin. I'm just very excited again to, to highlight the work that Rochester educators do. There's so many amazing uh, educators across um, the whole spectrum. Natalia says she was not expecting this honor. No, no, not at all. All the finalists are just great, amazing educators. I'm just happy to, to bring their voices uh, with me and, and just to share uh, what we think education uh, needs to do as we move forward in a year post-pandemic. You know, I've been here about a month, and um, in the first week, I started hearing about Natalia. New interim superintendent for Rochester Public Schools, Kent Pacal, is excited for what this means for the school district. I hope also that it lets people in this community know the kind of amazing educators we have, not only at Century High School, but in Rochester Public Schools. She's being recognized throughout the state of Minnesota for the hard work that she does as an English learner and ethnic studies teacher. There is a unique power to teacher leaders who are directly still in the classroom working with kids, but who have the chance to help lead. Um, and she's definitely done that with our Employees of Color Resource Group. She's done it on curricular issues. Um, she's done on community issues. I think she's helping to kind of paint a picture of where our district um, can head and, and needs to head. And as Minnesota Teacher of the Year, Natalia still gets to stay in the classroom doing what she loves. So that's exciting. Uh, that's the reason why I became a teacher. And so staying in the classroom is important to me, and I get to do that. In Rochester, Mackenzie Davis, ABC 6 News.